What is up, Saxon family? If you don't know who I am, my name is Jeff Saxon, and this is my channel. Make sure to strap on in with that seatbelt, guys, because today, what I have for you is a meal prep video. That is right, guys. A lot of you guys have been asking, like, yo, Jeff, can you do a meal prep video? Show us what you've been cooking to, like, you know, eat healthy and all that. And don't worry, I got you. Let me just, let me just dive right into my fridge real quick. Open this on up. Oh, hey, this is all the stuff we're going to kind of be cooking today. But there is more. Let's open up the freezer and uh, no, we don't want that today. We're gonna want some broccoli, steaming bag, and we're gonna also want some good old corn. By the way guys, do me a favor, if you guys are gonna enjoy meal prep videos, drop a like on it down below. It helps me out a lot. It lets me know what you guys wanna see because you guys know most of my content is now based around my weight loss. So it just helps out a lot. And also real quick, just thank you. Thank you to everybody that has still been like supporting me on this journey, either by reaching out to me on Twitter at Jeff Saxon Vlogs, at on Instagram maybe at Jeff Saxon Vlogs, or even down below in the comment section, guys. Your support does mean the world to me, and I just want you guys to know that anybody can do this as long as you put your mind to it. You can do it. So right here, we actually have some good old Tyson chicken breasts. Uh, this one is about I want to say 3.6 pounds. And uh, this one here is also 3.5 pounds. And if you guys are wondering, why, Jeff, did you get two? Well, I'm trying to prep for this week and next week, trying to just get ahead of schedule. Because if you guys don't know, you can actually cook chicken and then put it in the freezer to have it frozen until you're ready to reheat it and actually eat it. So, might as well get ahead of the game and actually get a lot of food cooked. So I know there's honestly a lot of different ways on cooking chicken, so you can actually do it on a stove, you can do it in the oven, or you can actually also do it in a grill, but unfortunately I do not own a grill. So I actually just put a little oil in the pan, put my piece of chicken in the pan, and basically let it cook. Now in a little bit, what I'm going to do is actually just flip this over and, you know, make sure both sides get cooked until the inside is actually nice and white and no longer pink. But I think I'm just going to actually take this uh, amount of chicken here and actually just put this in the the freezer and just save this for next time I actually do a meal prep because I don't think I need that much chicken cooked today. So one thing I gotta actually do is just turn the heat source down just a little just so it's not too hot while this piece of chicken is just cooking. So when it does come to meal prep I actually prefer to cook all my like meats first so if I actually make ground turkey which I did the other day which is already in the fridge so if I make turkey or chicken, I prefer to actually cook that first and then do the steamed uh, broccoli, steamed rice, and also steamed corn. But if you're gonna eat rice, actually eat brown rice, it's a lot healthier for you. Okay, so what I'm about to do right now is just take this little doohickey thing here and actually show you guys the chicken right now. Look how good that honestly looks, yo. Like, I'm actually pretty proud of myself. Like, a few months ago, I didn't really like to cook. All I would do is get fast food, and now a few months later, here I am, actually just cooking. Let me uh, see if this is ready to get flipped over just real quick. Oh, yeah. Cooking good. I'm actually uh, really happy with how I've been cooking. What I'm probably going to do is actually take a knife and fillet the rest of these so they're a little bit smaller, and uh, they're just not that big. Okay, so while I got that big piece of chicken over there actually cooking at the moment, what I'm going to do is take this butter knife, because it's like the only knife I currently have, I actually have to get a new knife set, and just kind of cut this in half, uh, just so it can actually speed up the cooking process, and also at the same time, it'll give me more chicken to actually eat later uh, down the road, aka the week itself. So I'm just going to cut this basically into two and split it on up in half. And uh, at that point, basically, it'll give me, like I was saying before, more food to eat this week. So basically, it's not filleted into two pieces. So what I'm gonna do is take the rest of the chicken I currently have uh, that is actually out and just do the same thing over again. Yeah, so I didn't vlog it, but <laughs> I accidentally set my fire alarm off while cooking. Got everything going on in the background, but yeah, the fire alarm is right up there. Had to open my door over there to just stop the uh, noise of the detector going off. So yeah, I just 
I let way too much smoke basically come out of this pan. So I'm not gonna do that again. I'm probably just gonna switch to the bigger, bigger thing to cook. Well, as you can see, most of the chicken is now cooked. We're on to the final two pieces right here. So I'm pretty excited about that. Now what I'm gonna probably do is just actually start cooking, well not really cooking, but microwaving the corn and also the broccoli. Okay, so now we're gonna start the vegetables. I'm gonna take this corn here, throw it into the microwave and put this in here for about five good old minutes and then corn will be cooked. So five, zero, zero, start and boom. Corn be done, and now I'm going to do the same thing with broccoli next. I am not going to lie, though. That chicken does look pretty good. I mean, well, this chicken at least does look pretty good. The cooked chicken. This right here, though, should be done. I'm going to actually have to uh, try and flip this. As you guys see, we're losing the pinkness. I don't know how well you guys can see it. But the chicken is starting to actually turn. Well, actually, here. That's a good example. That's still pink. Starting to turn white. This one here it has a lot more white on it. So I'm just going to flip it over. As you see, that side's already cooked. So yeah, this is actually a lot easier than some people think. And well, guys, there it is. Good old chicken, broccoli, and corn. That right there is my food that I have prepped for the week. So if you guys enjoyed this video, do me a favor, drop a like on it down below. Hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications. And until next time, guys, it's been your boy Jeff, keeping it real. I'm going to log out. I'm going to peace out. And well, pa 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 pa, peace.